This couple have been unmarried for so long, they're beginning to look married. The other night they had their first anniversary. Unmarried for a whole year. And they said it wouldn't last. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, good evening. Uh, tonight we've invited ourselves, along with 600 journalists, to a small gathering in East Finchley. It's to celebrate the first happy year in the unmarried life of the Queen of the King's Road, Fenella Filthy Rich, and her close friend, her very close friend, of course, that well-known middle-aged teenager, Mr. Gordon Scroggins. Well, I know they're here somewhere, so if you come with me, perhaps we'll have a word with them. <laughs> Oh, this, uh, this seems to be the happy couple now. Uh, excuse me, I, I'd like to interview you. I, excuse me, I, I want to interview you for 24 hours. <laughs> oh, I think I've got rather a lot of things to do during the time. Well, uh, I, I wonder if I might, if I might join you. Idiot, be our guest. But do mind that fag. We don't want the comfy couch to go up in flames, do we? <laughs> no, it's all gas, you know. Yeah. Well, 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 this is a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> what a str strange city, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, it's, it's fun furniture. And, uh, you can say that again, <laughs> Well, now. You've been together now for 50 weeks. And it don't seem a day too much. <laughs> have, you, uh, have you ever considered getting legally married? Oh, no, absolutely not. I mean, marriage is just an outmoded <laughs> archaic gimmick. I mean, as far as we're concerned, it's dead as a dodo, isn't it? Uh, oh, dead as, dead as a dodo, because we, we feel, we feel, we get all the perks all, and none of the responsibility. I mean, sex is a terribly important thing, isn't it, Eve? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you see, it is far too important to be confined only to married people. I mean, as far as he's concerned, he could never stand the restrictions of married life. He needs to be completely free as an individual if he's going to succeed in his work. Oh, uh, you do work then? Yeah, well, of course. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oh, thank you. Of course I will. I'm, I'm an active member of FUF. FUF? <laughs> yes, it's, it's the Finchley Foundation for Universal Freedom. It's a small army of poets and folk singers. All we want is world peace. Yeah, and we don't mind who we have to kill to get it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm you. <laughs> now, Mr. Scoggins. Uh, oh, sorry, where are you? <laughs> Well, as, uh, as far as marriage is concerned, I suppose you wouldn't even go through the motions. Oh, we did through the motions. See, the other night we had, we got stoned up here and we had a bit of a mock wedding. It was a right send-up, wasn't it? Oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> One of our chums had his roll-top shirt on and pretended to be the vicar. <laughs> and you put your old boy's scout toggle on my finger as a mock wedding ring. <laughs> I, you've got your wire underneath me, don't you? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I had my picture on the, on the front page of the papers, uh, running down Finchley Road at three o'clock in the morning. Running? Yeah, I had my beach caught in the black mirage. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a grand occasion, isn't it? Um, a lot of people here, many celebrities. Oh, and the most beautiful instrument. Really? Yeah, we've never shown it to me. Oh. <laughs> and look who's over there. I know, well, there you are. You see the stoop shoulders, the cowboy boots, the thick, fuzzy hair, all matted and tangled. Yes, it's Jimi Hendrix. Do you mind? That mummy. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, who's, who's the gentleman over there in the loincloth, standing on his head in the corner? Oh, that's Mummy's private Maharishi. He has several small spots on the Ganges. That's a very painful. <laughs> well, I'm off to bed, he. Well, what, what are you going to bed for now, girl? Well, I'm filming at six in the morning. Mm. I'm doing another bedroom scene with Terry Stamp. <laughs> How come? Five years in radar, and all you do is strip off in pictures. Only 
if it's essential to the plot. Mm. Uh, what film is it? Little Women. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You'd better wake the kids up, because this waving part, it seems it could have gone on all night. Just a minute. You have children? Of course we have. We're normal, and we? Of course we've got kids. <laughs> We've got four by three previous marriages, and I've got three by four previous marriages. <laughs> Oh, Lord. You'd better come too, he. Well, what's up then? Your kids and my kids are fighting with our kids. Oh. <laughs>